CBS Young and the Restless Spoilers documentary that when she heard that Diane was locked up in prison on suspicion of murder, Phyllis was overjoyed. She seemed to want this to be true. But if Phyllis reappears, everyone knows she is still alive, then surely Diane will be released only. No one dares to arrest her. Jeremy died at the hands of Phyllis. She was on the run from the police, but she still appeared often in crowded places. She even wanted to go to jail to visit Diane, provoke, and insult her. But it can't be. Phyllis will be arrested immediately. Jeremy is widely rumored to be alive, but it doesn't mean much. What if he's still alive? Phyllis is currently hiding. No one knows where she is, alive or dead. Jack, Kyle, and Michael trust Diane. She doesn't do bad things, so they're willing to do everything to let others know that she's not the killer. It's awful. Jack Abbott wants Allie to help him get Diane out. Allie has a bit of a clue about Jack and Diane's relationship, as well as whether Kyle is Jack's biological son or not. If Jeremy is still alive, then human Phyllis's life will not really be as peaceful as it is now. She will have to face a lot of threats. Jeremy was a tough enemy. He would do anything to let Phyllis die. Chance is investigating Phyllis's death, and where is Jeremy? If it can be verified correctly, everything will be solved. Chance and Michael are currently Jack's teammates and betray Victor. Diane has a high chance of getting out of prison soon. No one has killed Phyllis, so she's just running away. So Jack is very careful when dealing with enemies. Jack used to cherish and love Diane very much, but because of many different factors, everything became complicated. Diane begs Jack for help. She's not a killer. As we all know, Jack is always blinded by love and makes bad decisions. Diane has seen the figure of Phyllis pass by, but was unable to run after her, but was being held captive. Who is Diane's father, and where is he? Why didn't he come back to help his daughter? Phyllis won't come back. She's willing to trade her future in Genoa, but in exchange for her nemesis Diane being loved and taken care of, too bad. Phyllis is not afraid of anything. She's just worried that Diane will be released soon, which makes some people have eight barrels. How do you feel about this incident? Will Phyllis save Diane from prison and replace her in prison? Mm -hmm.